honey. Come on. Come on. Don't let me down. Don't be going upside down, mate. Come on. Look at that. Morning. Look at this. Beautiful, hey? Back on the home of the Shaw Hunter YouTube channel here in Dorset. As you can see, I've got my rods out. Don't worry, I'm not fishing. I'm just ready to go. I've got a cup of tea. I'm sat back and relaxed. Fishing with my mate, Matt. It's a bit close, isn't he? All right, Matt? No, it's fine. We're all good. Today you join me on a Saturday. It's quite busy, or busier. As you know by now, I don't really fish on a weekend. But I've just come back from Norway. And the missus is away. So I'm out fishing on a weekend. How you all doing? Naturally, I'm good. I'm fishing. Or I will be in a minute. Today's target, yet again, will be codlin or cod. Hopefully I can pick us up a bigger one. Hopefully I can just get us a target species. I'm just clipping this up and I'll show you. How beautiful is this? It's not gonna stay like this though. At 11 o'clock, it's gonna hammer down. So as you can see, well, you can't really see. You might be able to see. I've got my cod loop from the shorehunter.com. My rigs, yeah, a little plug straight away. Loaded with frozen blacks. Fresh frozen, because I froze them myself. Anyway, let's pop it out there. Let's do some fishing. Welcome back, everyone. Welcome back to the beautiful Chesil Beach in Dorset. As you know by now, I didn't really need to tell you. My name's Wayne. Let's do some fishing. Nothing fancy. Got a bit of a steep bank behind, so I can't welly it today. The recent storm has put a pretty pattern on the beach, which means it's not very flat. Just tighten this reel up. I didn't put it on properly. And there we are, first one in. Just like that. I don't need that. Bing. Oh, welcome back. Oh, let me get a rig. I am here, don't worry. You're not on your own. Right, I've got one of my loop rigs. The cod loop. If you watched my previous video, I've done all right. Caught some codlin, caught some bream. Yeah, it's good. Last time I had three cod in 15 minutes. Then I didn't get one for four hours. I just caught bream. What I've got yet again is my frozen blacks that I froze myself. Backpacks froze. Mm, simple stuff. As you know, first light is my favourite time. So I'm pretty confident. We've got a 4.1 metre tide, which is quite big for Chesil. And high water is half past nine. Absolutely perfect. It's six o'clock now. So we're going to fish all the way up till high. Fish over the top. And fish till about 12 o'clock. Yeah. On a Saturday. The missus is away in Devon with Finlay. So I can do what I want. I'm just going to walk around the house in my pants. Eating. Black lag, bait needle. It's not a breath of wind. 
I'll get you on the sea in a minute. It looks like a pond. Bind it on loosely with some fine elastic. If you do it too hard, you won't get it off a needle. Just so you can move it like that, look. That look weird. Get the hook. Like this. Slide out. Pop it on. <coughs> Slide to stop it down. I think I just had a fly go in my mouth. And there you go. Perfect doll. So we're gonna fish three and a half hours up, three back, until it starts pissing down. By that time, we should have had a few fish. I'm not promising. But I am. Right, what I'm going to do, cast from here, but cast over that way. Because this has actually come round a little bit. I'm not going to belt it. Same as before. Gentle cast. Eighty yards, probably. Probably not even that. Leave it nice and slack. How's my bum? Does it look big in these? Ooh. Look at that! Voila! We're fishing. I'm excited. And sat line. Okay. As you know, I love a sausage. But I like a big meaty one. But I've got, well, I went to Home Bargains actually and bought some sausages. So they're probably made up of eyes and assholes. But to be honest, I'm not fussy today. Can we get a first cast fish? First light, incoming tide. Nice bait. Amazing rigs. There you go. Oh my God. Right on cue. The left hand rod's just pulled round. Look at that. <laughs> it's just pulled me round. I've got two hooks. That could be a codlin. Yeah, there's a fish on there. I'll leave it for a minute. Why am I panicking? Drink your brew, son. Yeah, look at that. There's a fish on there. Yeah. Oh, that's a good start. Fish 
Sean. There's a bit of weight on it. Must have got a double shot. What I need to do is turn the camera around, right? The moment I have to put the rod down to bring the camera around and hope the fish is still on there. Yeah, no worrying. Look how beautiful it is. This could be a double shot, or it could be a better one. Hey, welcome to Chesil Beach. You know I tell you this all the time, that it's the best beach in the country. Oh, what have we got? I'm saying codlin, but I'm sure this game. Oh yeah. And we got a codlin. Been out there five minutes. And there we are, beautiful, eh? What an absolutely beautiful fish. Fin perfect. And there we go, everyone. First cast on the mighty Chesil Beach. Let's get this one in the bucket. Let's get another bait out there. And hopefully I can get us a few more. Cheers, everyone. I've got that fish in a bucket and I let it go in a minute. It was just lip hooked. Sometimes with these little ones, they, um, they nail it. They're all in size. But the ones that I just hooked in the lip, I just put straight back. Let me just get this out there. I'll show you it and then we'll get her away. Beautiful morning. They absolutely love these fresh blacks or fresh frozen blacks on my cod loop. Just nail them. Not really much tide either. When we get tide, we get more fish. I know that. Whip out there. Nothing fancy. Matt was just saying there's no tide, there's none at all. When we get a bit, we'll get a few more fish. Do we need any more? I don't know. It's a good start. A bucket with a fish in it. Just the way we like it. Oh, hello. And there we are. A beauty. Five pound. Two pound. Eight pound. Two pound. No jokes aside, let's get this little chap back and look at him. Come on. Look at that for a fish. What a beauty. Smells nice. I love smelling things. Not old people at bus stops. That'd be weird. But yeah, what a beautiful fish. Let's get him away. Look at this. Ready? Come on. Come on. Don't let me down. Don't be going upside down, mate. Come on. Look at that. <laughs> Look at him. He's having a little swim around. Hello. What a beauty. Goodbye, Mr. Codlin. See you in a few years' time. It's gone. Let's go. Right, I've just put that codlin back. Look at my right hand rod. It's just slacking off, pulling down. Slackening off, pulling down. I've only been fishing five minutes. There you go, let's see that. Oh, there's a fish on there. What a great start to a session. Look at it, it's beautiful. Oh, the left one's come back as well. Here we go. Right, I was just gonna pick it up and now it's completely slack. So let's have a look at it, let's bring you around. That's not me, that's my camera tripod making that noise. 
Look at that up there. Shall we have a look at this? Come on then. Look at that. And there we are. We're in again. Doesn't feel as big this one. What I'm going to do is bring you down so you can watch this come through the water. Oh, pull him back now. Let me concentrate on this a minute. I'll drop you down when it's in place. What have we got? Oh, there's a little breeze. Why is that that little? Woohoo! Let's get him away, shall we? They're right in there. Let's tea bar him in the bucket. Right, I'll show you him and I'll get him away. It's gonna go mad, I know it. And there we are. First cast on the other rod. Wow, we're on the fish this morning. Cheers, Mr. Bream. Cheers, everyone. Look how clear it is. Unbelievable, eh? Let's go, little Breamy. Come on, then. you're good, okay? Look at him go. Look at that. Look how amazing that is. He's gone. Simple stuff, 50, 60 yards again in the fish hole. It's a bit further over, not too much further. Just drinking my brew. And the left one's just pulled round. Looks more breamy. I've got another brew. Fish and brews. It's like boats and hose, but different. Same outcome. Lovely. And where am I? Uh, Mike's are probably saying super loud. Sorry about that. There's mackerel jumping out here. I've not actually bought my spinning kit this time. I knew I'd be flat out on the rods. Third cast. I had a fish on both. I oh, cast them both at once after the fish, so this could be three fish in three casts. Not sure what it is. Obviously, it's a big, powerful rod. But for a big rod, it's got great bite sensitivity. As I mentioned before, it's got everything you need. If you're a big hitter, it can do that. And as you've seen, I'm just flopping it out there. It does that as well. You get what you pay for, for sure. What have we got? Oh, well, what have we got? We've got a swimmer. Ooh, let's get this one. Oh. Oh. Oh, I need to smash yourself in the grid there. I've got myself in the face. And there we are. A Brimo. Not the biggest. Not the smallest. A welcome sight on a September morning here 
in beautiful Dorset. There you go everyone, another beautiful bream here in Dorset. Let's get this one away. Pop it. Right, if you keep an eye on the left one. That little pull down. Looks like a brain. When it goes again, we'll look at it, shall we? There you go. Right, that's a breamy, breamy, breamy. This has gone right down tight. Hmm. Heavier this one. Oh, what have we got? That's a bad one. Yeah. And there we are. A Chesil Beach codlin. Right in the lip. Let's get them in the bucket and we'll get them away. Oh, come on. And there we are. Another fish. I've only wound in once without a fish. Not moaning, mate. But there you go. A beautiful Chesil Beach summer codlin. Well, it's September now. It's on the change. Cheers, Mr. Codlin. Right, I'm even putting the brew down for this, alright? So serious. The right hand one, slackened off. That's not slackened enough. Slackened off and pull back round. That's quite a lot of tide now, so we've definitely got a chance for a better fish. So now I'm fed and watered, I need to fish. That's what you're saying. Ooh. Probably stuck in the bottom then. Oh, what have we got here? This could be something different. As you can see, we've got plenty of water. What I'm going to do is turn you around. I'm not sure what we got. Sure, we're going to find out though. It's a bit wintry now. Got a bit of weed. It's not gonna help, is it? Maybe I've got weed and a fish. A leader nut, whatever it is, is swimming. What have we got? We have got a bream. And there we are. A little black bream. Anyway, I'll get that chap straight back. Oh, bloody hell, had a bite on both then. As you can see, I've only got one rod in the water. I think I've only wound it in once without a fish. To be honest, Matt won't mind me saying, he's blanking, using pulleys. Yeah, it's a... Uh, it makes a massive difference, the rigs. Yeah, normal pulleys, which, you know, most of us would have used. Don't get me wrong, pulleys are fantastic. It's crystal clear, though. This one's right down tight. Might have a little bream or something there. Oh. Yeah. Just got some weed. 
Ah, well, that's the second time we've walked in without a fish, all right? But I was saying, all the fish I've had, and Matt, he's not had any, and he's fishing the same distance as me. Different rigs. Unbelievable. As you can see, Matt's walking back. I've given him some rigs. I give him bait and I give him some rigs. Well, he actually bought some bait off me because he didn't have any and I just shared my bait. Cause that's the sort of guy I am. And I've sorted him out a rig. Hopefully I can get him a fish. I can't just sit here while he's not catching. And he's fishing really well. But I don't know, the rigs are killing it. The cod loop rigs. Right, let's get this out there, shall we? Simple stuff. I've got a massive bank behind me, so I'm not whacking it. Get up high. There you go. Simple cast. Doesn't seem very deep at the moment because I'm still used to Norway. But it is quite deep for the UK. Right, let's sit back now. Let's get some more fish. Let's take these down. I keep putting them in the rest. I'm so used to it. Let's get them low. So we do not get neck ache. Nah. Let's go. I just thought I'd bring you back. Look at the rods. Do you like that? Do you like that, mate? I just thought I'd bring you back. Do a bit of fishing with me. Matt into a fish. Has he got one? Matt won't mind me saying he's a really good angler. Just. Yeah, it's just not been his morning. Looks like he might have something this time though. I had it a couple of weeks ago with Gemma, didn't I? I was fishing next to Gem. She kicked my ass. I was targeting a different species. But yeah, it can happen. I'd say he's into a codlin. I'm not sure where from, but it's got really windy meat. Yes. Unless he's got a big spider. What's he got? What's he got? Oh, he's got a fish. He got a fish? That's fishing, we love it, eh? That's what it's all about. As you know, sometimes it's me. I do it, I stink the place out. But look, we're gonna keep fishing. You get into a fish in a minute. I'm going to keep trying. If I get any more action, I'll bring you back. This is Chesil Beach. My name's Wayne. He's Matt. Between us, we'll try and get you some more fish. And hopefully, I've made you a decent video. Just slowly going to start packing up. Been a great session again. Done all right recently, which is nice. Trying out new rigs, that's working. Yeah. What have we got? Ah, oh, got. Sorry, Matt. <laughs> I literally cast next to him on the same rig. <laughs> oh. And there we are, a beautiful black bream. Oh, sorry. And there you go everyone, there's a beautiful black bream here on the mighty Chesil Beach. Let's get this one away, but we're on the fish. Wow, I've caught some fish today. I'll get this one away. Let's get him in the bucket. 
Let's wind the other rod in and make our way out of here. Anyway, everyone, as I mentioned, we're going to get out of here before it absolutely hammers down. I've really enjoyed this morning. Hopefully you have. I caught plenty of fish on my new rigs. The cod loops on the shorehunter.com. It's not about selling rigs on my channel, but it's nice to show you that I come out, I try something new and it's been working lately. It doesn't always work like that, but yeah, no, it's fine. But look, that's it. Let's pack up. This has been the beautiful Chesil Beach. I have been Wayne and I look forward to seeing you somewhere else very soon.